This is how to assemble my 3D printed butterfly engine. Right off the print, uh, these are the four parts that we need to assemble together. Start with the piston, sand the four sides until it has a smooth fit inside here. A smooth fit which goes all the way down and all the way out and like all around. And rubbing it will also help, so like a combination of just rubbing it back and forth and sanding until it's smooth. And once that's smooth, just do this. So that, that square fits into that square hole. And then now it's assembled. But I, I didn't assemble it correctly because um, I didn't want you to wait for me to sand it. So I have to take this back apart and sand it. But, and then you would just blow air or like any air source. Like it could be a vacuum or it could be a, a pump or a, a air compressor. And then you just put it in here. And then it should spin in the direction you put the piston in. as Because this piston is not symmetrical. The piston is kind of, in a, in a sense, its own valve. So if you put it in this way and apply pressure, then it will, the engine will spin this way. But if you rotate it, put it this way and you apply pressure, the engine will be built to rotate this way. And that's pretty simple. If you're finding, if you want to like really run this engine hard, then, or if this connection is loose, like kind of right now, then you would need to have put some super glue on it just like put a tiny bit of super glue there and then it would be good.